Butterflies, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another daily vlog. <laughs> right now, I'm up super early. Um, I'm actually gonna make another crop pot meal today, so I am up preparing it right now. I got the crop pot on, that's my phone. <laughs> um, my father in law brought over a roast, a pork roast, so I'm going to make that today. And he really hooked it up <laughs> and brought me a couple ingredients because I didn't know how to make it the way that he made it. So he brought a couple ingredients. Um, there's some cilantro. Hold on, let me take this out. I got some cilantro. And then I think this is the, the green onion. I'm taking it all out because I'm going to... Hold on, let me grab my, um, my chopping board. My... Because <clears throat> okay. I have to chop a lot of this up right now. So, I want to start with this early this morning because I need to prep it and get it in there for the day. Because it's going to take about maybe, I think, four to five hours. So, yeah. And then I brought, I think this is comino and it looks like oregano and a garlic piece. All in one. And then some onion and some chili powder. So, that's what I'm going to put in it. And this is the, oh, hello. This is the roast. <laughs> it's frozen right now, of course. So I'm going to put it in there again. And then I'm going to add a little bit of water, which I'll do that in a minute. But I'm going to chop all these. Uh, oh, one second, guys. Butterfly, sorry about that. Got a phone call from the hub. <laughs> all right, I got all my ingredients in right now. I'm just going to chop a little bit of onion and throw that in there. And then let it go for the five hours. Check on it maybe every hour. I've been on a crop bar kit these last couple days and I didn't expect my father-in-law to bring this roast I'm excited because I think we were supposed to have chicken today too but um I good thing I forgot to take it out yesterday I got so tired <laughs> but um but yeah you guys so I'm excited to try this I love a good roast okay I love me a good roast okay I love crop pot meals I just didn't I think that's why my crock pot broke because I used it so much. <laughs> but um, yeah, guys, I wanted to start with this early uh, in the vlog because I need it for one, like I said, to prepare this. And two, this is what I'm doing. <laughs> so welcome to the vlog. <laughs> um, today I have um, not really much to do, so I wanted to show you me doing a little bit of this cooking. And then um, I just have to do, of course, every day, all my life, every day dishes <laughs> but I'm not going to show you the dishes that I'm going to do off camera that's just what I have to do today and then um I was going to do a little bit of pick picking up the house I have to I mean the house is clean I have to wipe down stuff so if I do that maybe I'll show you guys that I don't know we'll see because I don't I like to show me cleaning you know because like it's I don't know to me it's satisfying to see people clean I don't know why not only that, I think, you know, you get an idea of what they use and stuff like that and how they, you know, how they do their cleaning. So, um, yeah, guys, I would like, you know, um, hold on, I'm putting the onion right into that roast. That roast. I'll show you it right now when I get it all in there, but yeah, so, um, yeah, not a whole lot going on today. Not a whole lot going on today. It's a little cloudy cloud cover. Sorry, I got onion in my eye. Oh, the torture. <laughs> that was not cool. <laughs> I never get, I'm one that never really gets onion in my eye. But today, I did. <laughs> okay, all that to end. I like these crop pot mills because, girl, you just throw them in and dinner done for the day for you and you can go and watch a movie and have some time to yourself <laughs> like I did the other day when um in the last vlog <laughs> but um anyways guys let me show you this real quick I'm gonna put then I'm gonna put the lid back on and then we can go chat in the living room I gotta make some coffee I'm gonna make some cafecito I haven't had my coffee cafecito this morning um, I just wanted to come and start this real quick as soon as I got up because I needed this to start going for the day. You always have to put your crock pot mills on early in the morning or the night before. I prefer early in the morning. It's a little fresher, you know, especially a meal like this that 
the whole roast is um, completely frozen. And I love this crock pot that um, my father-in-law let me uh, borrow because it gets super hot and it cooks the food really, really good. And some crock pots you can't, you have to let things thaw out, you know, before or it doesn't cook it right. Uh, but this one, she's the winner. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna add a little bit of salt real quick to the roast. Okay, just a little bit, not a lot. And then let me show you how it looks. It already looks good. <laughs> that roast, guys, look at that. Ooh, -wee, it's gonna be so good. It looks like I put a lot of onion, but there's water, a little bit of water, and then it's going to, uh, the meat's just gonna supposed to just fall apart throughout the cooking process. So I hope I didn't put too much water. He said like half, like like at the bottom. So, and this is my father-in-law's recipe. So I'm excited to try it. <laughs> um, so let me go and uh, put the lid on, and then we'll come back here and check on her later on today. But let me see if I can get the light on. You can see a little. There we go. You can see it like better both ways. It's the true colors, <laughs> and they've the the light colors. So. All right, guys, let that go, and I'll come back here and check on her later. Too much. This is just what I'm dealing with dish-wise. I just use that right now. And then I have a few dishes on this side, some pots to do. But um, my pot right here, I just brought out my beans to throw out because I made homemade beans the other day. And uh, we're going to have that, too, with the roast. Check out the roast. And then I'll just come in here and, like, clean these in a little bit after I have cafecito. And then just clean up around the crock pot and stuff. And then, um... Yeah, guys, move on with my day from cleaning. But this is that I want to tackle this, though, because I don't like the dishes to sit like that for very long because I have dishes that rust. So I got to do that. I'm going to take care of that in a little bit. Like I always say, but first, Jesus Christ and Cafecito. So we're going to make some, well, the coffee's already made. I'm going to actually just make me a cup. I'm not doing a Keurig today. I need to refill my water and clean it out, so I'm going to do that later. Oh, it's beautiful outside. I didn't realize how nice. Maybe we'll grab our cafecito and go sit outside. What do you guys think? I think I want to. Let's do that. I know I'm looking a little crazy today, but it is a cleaning day. It's a little tidy up today. I have to vacuum today. I have to um, probably mop and sweep today. So, ooh, hello. So I'm gonna look a little crazy. Let me put you guys on this tripod real quick. So I'm gonna make my cafecito and then we'll talk some more. Guys, I don't know what it is, but with a good crock pot meal, I feel accomplished. I don't know what it is because it's like, you know, you think about like, okay, you got a full day ahead of you of like some cleaning and then, you know, you got to cook later, but she was like, oh, like, like, if I clean and then cook, you know, I'm going to be really, really tired, you know, or, like, uh, it's going to be a lot that I got to do, you know, but I feel, like, accomplished. Like, I've already got dinner going, you know what I mean? Like, thank you, Jesus, to that, you know what I mean? And that's why I think in the future I'm going to have to repurchase a crock pot because I can't keep my in-laws crock pot. Uh, I love a crock pot now, like, you know, especially on my cleaning days. Always, if you got a crock pot, if you don't, it's okay, you know, like... You know, it's okay, just, you know, maybe you could borrow one, <laughs> but um, it's always good that you do a crock pot meal on your cleaning day, though, because then it kind of takes off, like, you can take your time and clean and not have to worry about chopping up stuff, preparing stuff, you know, you guys know all that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm going to make my cafecito right now. I just wanted to say that because I was like, um, I was like, dang, like, I forgot how good it felt to do crock pot meal on a cleaning day, which this is a cleaning day. I'm gonna do some cleaning. <laughs> um, ooh, look at that, look at her girl. Look at her, pour that cafecito. Not too much though, not too much. <laughs> oh, I would drink it like this and just, but I don't like black coffee, sorry. I don't like black coffee. I don't know, it has like a real bitter taste to me. So I have to some sort of creamer. Today, I'm doing the um, Italian sweet cream. <coughs> We're getting a lot of birds. Look at there's some birds out there. Maybe we'll, oh, hello, did you see that? Oh my gosh. Did you just see that? Look, it flew all over my shirt. <laughs> okay, anyways, let's pour this creamer. I'm not gonna pour too much though, about there. And then I have these little sticky sticks that were in my craft thing that I don't even use. I don't really use them anymore. And I use them to just stir the coffee. And then, and then I have a trash can right here so I can throw them away. 
So very super convenient. I love the way I got my cabecito going station going, you guys. I'm so blessed for this because it feels like I got up and went to a coffee shop. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I'm going to sit right here <clears throat> and I'm going to have my cafecito and I'm going to read my Bible <coughs> and then I'm going to come back to you guys and we're going to um, clean. I got to clean. I'm going to show you. I mean, it doesn't look like a lot, but girl, it's a lot. I'm going to start with my kitchen first though. I'm going to, I'm going to wash the dishes and then come in here and then I'm going to, um, uh, what am I going to do? Oh yeah. And then I'm going to pick it up and then take everything off the tables and wipe all the tables down. It's going to be a day girl. We're going to have a day. Um, so, oh no, wait. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm going to read and then we'll move outside to have some cafecito. Then we'll come back in here and do that. Cause I wanted to go outside for a little bit and just take a breather. Cause I have a lot more time today to get clean done, which I'm super excited about. You know what I mean? So cheers. Mmm, that Italian cream, so, de mwah, so delicious, you guys. You guys got to try it. Okay, I am trying to be on the healthier side with stuff. Soon, I'm going to transform uh, all my stuff, though, into healthier things, you guys. I will have the occasional, like, you know, bad creamers. <laughs> but I do want to pick up uh, some almond milk for, like, most of the week. And then maybe on the weekend, just have, like, a good, nice, yummy creamer, you know. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make it like a, you know what I mean? Because I'm trying to do a little good. I did get on the treadmill yesterday. I didn't show that though in my last vlog, which I have to get up that today too. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, so, uh, I did get on the treadmill for about 30, 40 minutes and oh, I felt so good, girl. I slept so good too last night because I wasn't going to do it after, uh, I ended the vlog, but I just. I got on the um, treadmill and it felt so darn good. I'm not going to go walk though um, because I'm trying to do like some things around the house and stuff and get a lot of things done this week. And um, I'm trying to utilize my whole day um, every day. You know, it is the middle of the week though, considering. So <laughs> that's why I haven't really got walking. Plus I was just tired the first day. Um, so yeah, guys. Anyways, enough talking. Let me go do what I said. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna sit down, drink my cafecito, and then I'm going to, um, wait a minute. What was I gonna say? Butterflies, I heard something, that's why I paused, and I was like, what is that? My phone was going off. Really? <laughs> anyway, no, I'm gonna, like I was saying though, I'm gonna go ahead and just, uh, <sighs> coffee sitting, okay? It's sitting, I can feel it. <laughs> it's sitting. <laughs> I'm like, duh, 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 duh. <sighs> take a deep breath, breathe. Okay. All right. So anyway, <laughs> back to the West Dane. Cafecito. Gonna um, read and then I'm going to continue taking my cafecito. We're going to take it outside. So let's go do that right now and then we'll go clean. Okay, butterflies, I was out here uh, with my to-do list. I have my other Bible, my NLT Bible, because I was, I know I got a, it had a sticker on it, so don't judge. <laughs> it had a sticker from when I went to a church event. It's loud out here, so bear with me, but I'm outside. It's a beautiful, beautiful day today. It kind of cleared up a little, a little bit more cloudy earlier, but I didn't catch it because I was doing some editing. So, I'm um, like, it is what it is, but it's loud. There's a lot of cars out here. But I'm out here planning and doing my thing. I was having a little bit of that uh, cafecito that I made a little bit ago. But, um, yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful morning out here, you guys. And it's a little bit of a breeze. And, oh, it just feels so nice out here today. So, I'm going to spend a little bit of time out here. And then I got to go inside and I got to start cleaning from the loud. You hear that? Really? Really? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, you guys. It's loud. Can't get really get any peace out here right now, but it's okay. I still want to be out here and get some air before I go in there and start kind of like really tidying up my house. And then, um, yeah, so 
yeah, I'm gonna go check on the food as well. But um, yeah, you guys, this is where I'm at. Meal planning, daily planning, and then I have my book under here where I check off like a lot of projects and stuff that I will uh, get done and stuff like that. But yeah, guys, really pretty. The birds are going crazy. I'm telling you, this is the feeder the birds were going nuts on the other day. Can you hear them? Like, tell me in the comments if you hear them, like, in the distant top, besides my loud voice. Yeah, like, crazy. Look how pretty and fluffy those clouds are. It's so pretty out here today. All right, guys, I'm going to get back to what I was doing. Loudness, the madness. <laughs> it's always loud, but I, you know, it's better than it being too, too quiet, though, you know what I mean? Oh, look at how pretty my little house thing is. It's so cute, the little bird house. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's still really loud out here, but I just got done. I don't, oh, I know I look crazy. I'm going to take a good shower later and get myself all the way together, guys. <laughs> I know I've been like lacking on taking care of myself lately. Um, not in a bad way, but just because I've been doing so much around the house and stuff and I'm getting ready to transform everything into Christmas stuff. So it's like, whew, it's a lot. But I'm getting some deep cleaning done today. Uh, right now, I was finishing up my planning stuff that I do for the day. Um, I didn't do any of this yesterday, which I should have did. And um, I also was reading my Bible study chapter because I like to study that. I like to, because the other Bible that I showed you guys, um, a little earlier was my church Bible, uh, cause our pastor reads out of, um, NKJV, sorry, I have something in my eye and, um, Bible study, we write, we read out of NLT. So, um, yeah, so that's why I have the two Bibles and I do two different like studies and stuff. Like, actually there's like three studies that I do because we have Wednesday service and then we have Sunday service and then I have Bible study service and then actually I'm doing four because then I have uh, my study that I'm studying. I'm in the book of John right now um, and uh, and then in uh, Wednesday service um, we're in Wait, we're in Hebrews and then Sunday Romans or I think it's the opposite I can't remember at the moment because like I'm doing so much reading and then um yeah so that's what I'm doing right now um yeah guys but keep reading though keep reading your bible it's good though it's good to read don't overcrowd yourself where you can't understand it though you know what I mean um but yes yeah, stay in your word um yeah, and then, uh, Bible study chapter, hold on, because we just started a new chapter, a, a new book, um, hold on, we are in the book of James, is it James? Yeah, I marked my, what do you call it? <laughs> You're like, don't you mark your book? Yeah, I do mark my book, <laughs> but, um, yeah, we started a new, a new, uh, a new book in the Bible. They call like James, you know, Hebrews, Romans, they call them books or, but I just call them chapters and study and stuff like that, you know, but, um, yeah, so, um, yeah, that's what I was doing right now. I'm finished though. So I'm going to finish my cafecito and then go inside and get this cleaning done. Got to get this cleaning done, girl. And then I'm going to take a really good bath later, do a face mask and stuff like that. So, yeah guys hope you're enjoying the vlog so far i'm just painting myself here at home but um yeah let's go get that cleaning done <laughs> i'm coming in i have my school my books here i feel like a little school girl with her school books <laughs> i'm bringing in my stuff right here um and i have uh jesus of nazareth on in the background playing and i don't care if i get copyrighted because i'll get copyrighted for jesus any day <laughs> Um, but I want him playing. I, I mean him, but I want anything that has to do with the Lord playing. <laughs> um, so yeah, I was gonna, I have it on. Um, if you guys don't know what Jesus of Nazareth is, it's a, it's a movie about the Bible. And it's literally like a three hour long movie, but I love it because it's, you know, it tells you the whole story of God and, you know, his crucifixion and everything. So, you definitely should check it out. I love that movie. Um, 
right now I am going to oh look at my hair <laughs> do you hear the the horns <laughs> I'm like Jesus coming back <laughs> um but uh right now I am going to start cleaning so let me I'm gonna lower it a little bit though so I can talk to you guys so hold on just so you can hear me well it's fine it's fine I'm just gonna leave it um but yeah so let me show you what I gotta do I have to wipe down these tables. I have to put that back inside of the kitchen. I have to, while the living room is tidied up, I have to um, vacuum and sweep and just straighten up and everything like that. And then, so it's really not a whole lot. It's just the wiping down of the tables. You can see there's some like, you can't really see it right now, but there's some like stuff on the table. And then I gotta, kind of tidy up this area and of course vacuum it needs to be vacuumed and then when you go to my kitchen I'm gonna take you with me this time I have to mop sweep the floors with food on the floor <laughs> and then I have to clean these dishes and counters so um yeah that's what I'm gonna do right now and that is my tidy up for the day I will go make my bed off camera and um yeah guys and the meat is looking it's it's looking like it's cooking <laughs> it's looking good it smells really good Ooh, that smells really good you guys that smells like a like um how does he say it um uh what is his name it's on uh the griswold he said it smells it looks real nice but this smells real nice <laughs> if you guys seen that movie you know what i'm talking about um but yeah guys let's get this done before I start, look at her. What's she doing out there? Uh oh, she's taking a little poopy in her area. But look at, <laughs> girl, what you doing? What you doing, girl? Look at her wagging her tail. You excited? Hi, mama. She look at her. <laughs> Happy. Oh, okay. Attitude. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm gonna get this started. <laughs> Teach my soul to sing your song Even when my eyes can't see When I can't seem to carry on I know your hand is guiding me I know your hand is guiding me I may walk But you were all I'll ever need Gave you life to take my fall So in the storm I will have peace So come the storm I'll still believe I'm at the end And I don't know what I believe Through the cloud I see your hand Reaching down to guide me You're always reaching down to guide me Cause I am yours and I am free
whistle to sing your song Even when my eyes can't see When I can't seem to carry on I know your hand is guiding me I know your hand is guiding me Through the valley I may walk But you were all I'll ever need Gave you life to take my fall So in the storm I will have peace So come the storm I'll still believe So I did most of the dishes. Well, I did all the dishes. I have um, these dishes in here, and I'll explain that in a second. Cleaned uh, this section <clears throat> of the uh, kitchen and did the the first half of dishes. I swept the floors. I do need a mop. I will do that in a little while. Um, but I have a little bit of just these dishes because I had just made me some brunch. These are two egg and cheese bites and a little bit of some bacon. Um, and I'm going to have this right now to put some fuel in my body and grab something to drink. And then um, come back in here and finish these dishes. Finish mop, uh, mopping. That's my phone. Come in here and mop a little bit. But I'm going to eat this real quick. And then come finish these. And then I'm completely done with the kitchen. And then on this side, I just got to put that board back on the stove. But it's kind of warm right now, so I can't put it there. But this looks delicious, doesn't it, guys? A little bit of some bacon. <clears throat> and a couple of egg and cheese bites. I've been, like, stuck on these. They're super easy. Mix your egg. I just put egg and a little bit of milk and mix it and then put the cheese all up in it and then put it in the oven for about 15 20 minutes let it brown at the top a little it's good when it gets a little crispy then just made me some a little bit this is actually three strips of bacon cut into half so it makes a little bit what is it three let's see there's one two yeah three cut in half so i'm gonna go eat this and then um yeah we'll continue cleaning I'm done cleaning. I just got a vacuum. I'm going to do that after I eat this lovely plate of food. And then I left the um, decor off the table for today. Um, I might need to wipe it down again later. Um, but I'm going to put it back on after dinner. Because me and hubby, like, I, I, we love to sit at the table. And lately with the decor on there, I can't really, we can't really sit. And then I don't want my decor to get dirty. So... We're going to leave it off for the day, and then right before I go to bed, um, I'll put it, I'll clean up the table one more time, and then, um, well, just the areas we eat on, and then put the decor back on. You see the cafecito station is going good. I need to throw that trash away, and of course, uh, vacuum this whole floor, guys. <laughs> but um, until then, I'm going to sit and finish watching uh, Jesus of Nazareth. Well, I'm not going to fit, I'm not going to finish it right now, I'm going to be honest with you, because it's a very long movie, but I'm going to sit and watch it while I eat my brunch and then we will continue this cleaning day and process this food looks so good I'm so hungry let me go eat this see you love me forever see it you'll be mine on this day on treasure Could it be like this for the rest of our lives? I'll choose you and bear all words I'll choose you even when it hurts I'll choose you Every chance that I take You'll never be sick butterflies as you've seen i'm done with the vacuuming oh it feels so good the house looks so nice 
See, the house was clean. It just needed to be vacuumed and the table needed to be wiped down for it to look extra clean. And that's what went on. I mopped the uh, kitchen right now. I'm taking a breather and a moment to relax for a minute, taking a little break. And then after it dried, I got to go in there and finish the dishes and put the rest of the dishes away. And then I'm completely done with the cleaning process of my day. So hopefully this cleaning motivation today uh, inspired you to get up and get it going, girl. You can do it. We can do it together. Look at our guns. Look at our muscles. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Um, I do have a couple other things that I need to do. I need to clean out my coffee pot and make my bed. I haven't done that. I did vacuum all of our room, the rooms, so, whew, did a lot today, girl. Did a lot. We were on it. I did it. I got through it. I was going to wait till tomorrow to vacuum, but I'm like, no, I'm going to vacuum today. It needed it today. It needed it really bad today, so did that um i will later on in the weekend do maybe like power hour see my cleaning days usually go from like the middle of the week and then a quick power hour um at the end of the weekend so um that's normally what i like to do just because it keeps the house clean and not backing up and building up because i am only one woman that cleans the whole house not all the time by myself hubby he helps me out a lot you guys see him cleaning and sometimes vacuuming but um when he's busy I do it on my own and so I have to like separate my days I have to uh pace myself because then that's when I tire myself out so in your cleaning remember you have a, if, if you're a stay-at-home wife like I am um then you know what you would do is uh spread out your days you have all all five days um, spread out your days, prioritize your days to your cleaning days, to your resting days, to your beauty days, uh, to your power hour days, and to your days to spend with your family because end your day and make sure you spend every single day with the Lord. <laughs> um, that's what I try to do. Like my, I'm not going to do like a daily routine video. I don't really like gravitate to doing those because, uh, I feel like what I'm doing and what I'm giving you guys is my routine <laughs> um because sometimes i don't set like yeah even though you see me do a to-do list it's things that i need to do but if those things don't get done every day they get spread out through the week and it goes on to the next day so that's how i i do things but i don't really have like a same day everyday routine every day something is different and oh yeah i changed my shirt if you guys didn't notice to a tank top because I started off cleaning with a long sleeve and I got really hot. I have both fans going right now and whew, after I'm done doing those other, the last three things, which is um, uh, making my bed, which I'm going to go run and do in a few and do the coffee. I got to clean the cafecito pot out, uh, out and refill everything. And then um, the dishes, I think I'll do the rest of the dishes though later before I go to bed or tomorrow, probably later before I go to bed because um, we're still going to eat that roast and I checked on it. Oh, girl, it smells so good in here and it looks so good. Oh, I hope it's done uh, by the time hubby gets home. So I'm like, oh my goodness, you know what I mean? So um, yeah, that's what's going on. I'm going to rest, take a breather, watch a little bit of Jesus of Nazareth because it's still going. It's been hours since I put it <laughs> but um i love it though i wouldn't want any other movie but you know what though when this movie is on, um over i want to watch my next favorite movie which is um uh hold on sorry i'm trying to fix this real quick <laughs> which is war room i love war room you guys hear me talk about it a few times it's a shadow right here i'm so sorry it's because i closed i closed one of the curtains because that side of the house gets really like warm like it brings in the sun a lot and I wanted to kind of keep it kind of cool in here. Even though it's not a hot day, I wanted to keep it cool in here and stuff like that. So I closed that and plus the lighting. When I'm filming in the dining room, I, the lighting, like, you'll just see the light. You won't see, <laughs> you won't see, um, like, me. You'll just see the light. And you don't want to see the light just yet, no. <laughs> no, if you do, though, make sure you're safe. <laughs> but um, at the same time, um, yeah, so that's what's going on with that. Um but yeah guys i'm tired i'm not tired tired i still have a little bit of energy in me i'm just like Whew, i need a breather <laughs> but uh i'm gonna stop talking because i'll sit here and i'll talk to you guys for days like i just 
I mean, I don't love talking, talking, but like, you know, when you spend most of your day by yourself and just you and the Lord, um, you want to talk to like at least a full person, you know, and you guys are the people I talk to. <laughs> so, um, you and the Lord I talk to all throughout the day. <laughs> so, um, until hubby gets home. So, um, yeah, guys, I'm going to stop talking and I'm going to chill and then I'll go finish those three and then I'll update you guys a little later when it comes to dinner and maybe do a little face mask and stuff like that. And, um, that's the day, guys. That's the day. That's my day. This is what I'm doing. So, I'll chat with you later. Okay, butterfly. Uh, as usual, it is a little chaotic here with the animals. <laughs> uh, it is the early evening right now. I look crazy. I'm tired, you guys. Uh, I already finished what I said I needed to do. I made my bed. Um, I fed my animals. Uh, I forgot to do that this morning, but they were okay. They still had water, and they had a little bit of food, but I, I wanted to kind of refill it a little bit more so they could eat enough. And um, change the cafecito. I cleaned all that stuff out. I think I already mentioned I made my bed. I finished the last bit of those dishes. Um, I put away some dishes. I have one dish that is soaking right now, so I'll probably just wait until like tomorrow morning when I get the dinner dishes clean to clean that as well. Um, but right now, I think I'm going to call it a vlog, you guys. Um, just because I don't really have anything else going on. I'll make sure and show you uh, my dinner, though, put together. And then, uh, you know, close it out with an out intro like I always do. <laughs> well, I almost try to always do, you know. But, um, it's a beautiful evening. I was going to go outside, uh, but I think I'll probably just go sit out there, give you guys some, like, a little bit of, you know, how nice it is, and then, um, show you my dinner, and then come inside and just chill. Uh, hubby will be getting home soon, so I am just want to end the vlog, and then just, I'm going to take a bath, and then probably get in some jammies and hit the hay you guys because i'm tired <laughs> i got a full day tomorrow as well i'm not doing things but getting things prepped for uh for uh bible study so um yeah so that's what's gonna happen um <clears throat> yeah guys that's about it for right now i think i'm just gonna go ahead and close her out and i hope you guys enjoyed spending the day with me cleaning i hope it motiv gave you a little bit of motivation to get up today and get what you gotta do done um yeah, guys, that's about it. I didn't show you my room. Uh, I told you my room is uh, it's under construction. So is the girls' room. Those rooms are under construction. My laundry room uh, is under construction as well, like certain types of construction. <laughs> and I just don't show those areas very often. My bathroom, I got a little bit of a tidy up today. Not a whole lot. Tomorrow, I think I'm going to have to clean her up a little bit more. But I threw out the trash, swept the floors, and cleaned the toilet, and wiped down the counter. That's like the basics that it needs. Um, so I really don't show that area too often. It's mainly just the front areas that, you know, need it like the most. Uh, I know the bathroom does, but, you know, it gets done. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, um, yeah, guys. I just, oh, uh, on the, on the, um. My, on my point about my room is that because it's under construction right now, I'm not showing you that part of my room, but it is getting, like, very cleaned out. I've been throwing a lot of stuff away, decluttering. Uh, me and hubby decluttered, like, a corner of our room that just, it's like a, it's like a pile all. <laughs> Everything that we kind of want to store away because we don't have a garage here. Um, uh, we, like, put it in that corner till we're going to store it away up inside the attic. But I'm trying not to store anything up in the attic no more. Uh, we are cleaning that area out, too, little by little. Every time Hubby goes up there, he throws stuff down and we throw it away or we organize it. And th th around this time of the holidays, it gives me a chance to do that as well because then I can organize my holiday stuff, get it into bins the right way. And then, um, th and then, like, in the future, like, in the future, future, if we ever move from here or whatever, I have it all organized and just ready to go. And I don't have to deal with a lot of other stuff up there because I had a lot of my mom's stuff up there, too. But it's mainly, like, movies and, like, VHSs and stuff like that and, um, like, a lot of her holiday stuff. And then it was um, just a bunch of random stuff that... <coughs> 
that was collected that we don't even need and it wasn't even ours. <laughs> um, so I told hubby he could just kind of declutter all that, clean it up real good. He did a very good job up there. I didn't go up there, but uh, he he showed me on pictures what he was doing, and I was like, hey, it looks better, you know. Because uh, I did go up there a long time ago. I hardly go up there. I don't go up there at all. Like, my, I, like I probably will go through the roof. <laughs> I probably will go through the roof. Um, but, <laughs> but yeah, so he showed me pictures and stuff. But I did go, like, halfway up on a ladder and look in there a long time, a while back. Probably a long time ago. It's been a couple years since I've done Actually, it's been a few years since I've done that. And um, it looked very disorganized and messy and that's why I wanted to start that project and doing it little by little when we can and we can't get up there normally it gets like a big time cleanup and a big time like looking at during the holidays when I'm taking stuff in and out and stuff that's why I wish that um I had a garage so that all my holiday stuff can go in there and I that's all I need is just my holiday stuff there's nothing that I keep up there everything that's down here is what we have we don't you know I've been decluttering try not to collect a whole lot of garbage a whole lot of stuff you know I know that a while back I got a comment about too much furniture but if you really were able to come into my house and see my house you would think wow, it's not a lot of furniture. It's stuff that is being utilized and used. Not that I care about that comment, you know. Um, it's just, uh, you know, I wanted to just go back on that and just say, you know, and just say that, you know, that um, we don't really have a whole lot of furniture. Every piece of furniture in this house has been used in a way it's supposed to be used. Except for one piece that I'm thinking about getting rid of, which is this, uh, let me show you real quick. Let me spin you around, which is, see that big piece right here? This one here, it doesn't get, oh, hello. <laughs> it doesn't get used very often. I was thinking about getting rid of it, but for the project that I wanted to do for it, I might keep it. Um, so I'm not going to say right now what I want to do with it. I do have lots of stuff organized inside of it that I do use, but I could always put it somewhere else and use it. Or maybe get another like shelf that I can really organize and stuff, but... For now, it's going to be the way it is. For now, the house is going to be the way it is. But we really don't have a whole lot of stuff um, and a whole lot of furniture. And then what does take out take up like a bulk of the room too is the treadmill and the dining room. Other than that, when we don't have that or we didn't have it, it was a really big open space. I could walk around the dining room table and sit. You know, we all sat at the table and stuff. But, um, yeah, so slowly it's getting decluttered though the whole house is getting a declutter even whatever's around here that i'm not using or haven't touched in a while or whatever but i usually use pretty much everything in this house so um but anyway i'm not going to talk anymore what i am going to do though is close this vlog out i hope you guys enjoy this vlog as much as i enjoy doing this vlog <laughs> don't forget to like subscribe and comment uh down below if you haven't and make sure you hit that notification bell so you guys know when my videos are popping up which is a lot lately <laughs> um and um yeah thank you for making it to the end of the vlog you guys will see me soon and i'll give you some uh end clips for some fun so i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye guys